Hey, what's up, guys? It is your boy, Wildfrock, and I talk all things hockey. This is episode number two of Brutally Honest Recaps. First episode was on the Ducks. Right now, we're going to the Arizona Coyotes. Make sure to like the video if you want and subscribe. It helps me a lot. Okay, thank you. So I didn't preface this before the Ducks video. I'm going to be toxic, but this is all for fun. I don't hate your team. It's just a joke. I was like, how oh, do you suck? You suck. You're about to play in an ASU arena and you're not going to sell out. Your arena is kind of sick, though. Your new one that they're trying to build is kind of sick. Not going to lie. It's not going to lie. Not going to lie. It's kind of sick. Not going to lie. The one very big positive in your organization is Papa Sinet is like, and it works for you. That's a W. A W right there, baby. That's a W biz. W biz. Some positives here. You have three first round picks, which is a fucking W. You guys have the third overall pick, which is very good. You can get a very good player in that position. But don't mess it up, guys. Come on. Don't mess it up. But three first round picks, which is very nice. Four second round picks, which is also very, very good. Either you can package a deal and get something. I doubt you guys are going to do that because I just doubt it. Playing Keller, I know he just like absolutely just is basically like paralyzed from fucking last season. But that's that sucked. But hopefully he's going to be okay. I'm guessing he will be. But hopefully he's the same player as last season if he can still walk. Barrett Hayton, nasty player. I like his upside. I think his ceiling is very high if if he doesn't say in Arizona. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Jacob Chicken, also very, very good. Let's see who you guys traded. You guys traded Oliver Ekman Larson and Connor Garland to the Vancouver Canucks. I was expecting more. They didn't really do that much as I thought, but it's whatever. It's just year one. Vancouver's not the greatest. Cool. Don't write. Okay, cool. Before to Montreal, cool. Montreal straight cheeks were fine. RC Kemper through the Avalanche. I know it was needed because Avalanche needed attendee and you guys aren't doing anything. So it made sense for you guys. But now you just handed him a Stanley Cup. You said, hey, Darcy. Hey, Darcy Kemper. There's a Stanley Cup. There's a cup. I forgot to say one more W in your organization besides Biz. Y'all have Phil the fucking thrill. Hot dog man is elite. I love that man, Phil. I'm a Pittsburgh guy. I love Phil, bro. I love Phil after the 2016-17 playoffs. I love my man, Phil. So that's a W right there. You guys are winning the cup next year. These videos are going to be short and sweet. So make sure you do not miss out any of my videos. But thank you for watching. Make sure you hit a like. Uh, Coyote fans, comment down below. Are you guys going to make playoffs? No, you're not. So you don't have to comment. I already know the answer to that. But no. How is your future looking? How do you think? Do you like your coach? Bring back talking. I like talking. He's a W. Biz, you're a fucking W if you're watching. You're not. But I love you anyway. But Coyotes, you suck. Logo's nasty. ASU. He's going to treat you well. Your players are going to get fucking hammered. Thank you guys for being here. Much love. This is all jokes. Bye. Subscribe. <laughs>